Hey, so, um, this girl wanted me to tell her how to do these beamy thingy majiggers. And this is obviously my very first tutorial because I've never even done tutorials. So I'm going to start, like, yeah. So, how do the beams? I just got this quick picture of Paige because it doesn't really matter. Anyway, I'm going to make it just to fit on screen. And, um, I'm going to grab the pen tool right here. Or you could just press, where's P? You could just press P on your computer. That's right there. Make sure it is selected on the this one, whatever it's called, because nothing's showing up and it hates me. And this one. And it says auto add and delete and this one. Yeah. Oh, add paths to area. Alright. Pat make sure it paths and the pen tool is selected. Yeah, so not free form or whatever, just the pen tool. And then um see some people like to have it just like bam, bam, bam. See like just weird and Really not, but whatever, Henry. Delete that. Um, I'm first. You just make a new layer, okay? And I just like it kind of near the person. Just looks like it's perfectly around. So just grab your pen tool and click right where you want it to start. Just right there. And then you click where you want it else, and you drag, and you drag, and you drag, and you drag, and. You drag and you drag and just click it off like that. Right, so some people, they kind of like like the beams to start over here. They go over here and over here and over here and over here, whatever. But I kind of like it no, close to the person because then it just looks better. Anyway, so now you're going to click on the little f -y, pinky thingy on the palette right here. You know, that right there. You go over it, it turns pink. So, and it has a little F. Anyway, so click that. And, um... Well, oh, wait, hold on. Uh huh, huh. First, you want to. Okay, I'm sorry. Forget not everything I just said. Make sure your foreground color is white. It looks better white, I promise you. And your brush should be just something small, like, you know, just like something small like that. So I'm putting mine to 13, right? And now click back on your pen tool and just press P again. And you go here and you press stroke path. Make sure it's brush. And you can press stimulate pressure, but I'm gonna show you the difference. When you click stimulate pressure, bam, you click OK. And see, when you press it like um I'll put actual pixels. See, it's like I'll delete the path. Realize how like it's lighter up here and it gets darker and darker. Or you could just go back and stroke path without it, and and then it's just perfect. Which I kind of like it more like this. So yeah, and then um, delete the path, and I'm gonna put it back to regular. Well, fit on screen, whatever, and go here. Um, most people just do outer glow. But I like mine to just look different, you know. I'm going to turn mine pink, just because I'm cool like that. Anyway, so now it's pink. But for some reason, I like dropping the shadow, because I'm extremely cool. So, yeah. And, you know, you can do bevel and balls. Ba ball. Bevel and emboss, and, you know, you can do whatever there. But I'm just dropping the shadow. So, okay. Now, you know that this lighter is selected. So now, grab your eraser tool. Right? You know, everyone knows who that is. And make sure it's a pretty big brush. And then just kind of race around her. Your person. You know, well, okay, that didn't really look accurate, so do it a little bit better. And you can leave that and make it a little smaller. And la 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 la. So mine doesn't look good at all, but when you do it, yours is going to look a little better because you're going to be trying and um then you can just kind of like put it like right there whatever you want and you know and put it right there of course I'm just clicking because I don't not really trying hard and there you go you have the beams yep yep you know or you could totally just like Wait, yeah, whatever. And um you could just cancel me no wait, no. Uh -huh. Delete that. 
Okay, nothing's deleting. Delete. Yes. Oh, there we go. So then you can just keep all that and then go right there, but, you know, and keep that or whatever, you know. Or some people just like to, like, make it look like it's going around there and it's over that, so that's what I did at first of all. So, yeah. Oh, yeah, by the way, you probably see that little black spot up there. That's because that's not on my computer. It's because my camera is just a regular camera, so it's why you don't see the whole screen. It's not like a screenshot thingy, majigger. So, if you're wondering what that is, that is it is. Anyways, so, this is another Photoshop tutorial. Um, have a nice day.